the wrong way. <laughs> Hi, welcome back. Uh, in one of the previous videos, we showed how to find an underground pipe. Yep. So we, we used the device, we found the conduit, and now we will have to pull the wire through this conduit. Um, we will use this first, first one is the string that has to go in. And this is the lightest thing because a vacuum uh, down the hill has to pull it. So we used the lightest string we could find and a plastic bag so that it has a volume. So we'll put it inside the pipe here and down the hill we'll suck it up with the, with the vacuum. And then once the other end of the rope shows up, we'll uh, pull it and then we'll pull a heavier, thicker rope uh, with the string up. And then once the rope is in, we'll uh, pull the actual wire with this rope. So it's a three-step process, but it uh, shouldn't take long. So let's start. So I'm gonna tie this bag with the string. It's just a regular plastic bag. It's kind of fluffy and light. Uh, and it's gonna go size long of the string long enough so it goes all the way with an extra string. So this one I think it's 500? 500. 500 feet. Uh, and we have just shy of 200 feet mm -hmm. distance to go, so that should be enough. So I'm just pushing it down, right? Yeah, pushing it down and waiting for me. Okay, it, go, it starts with a narrow passage and then the conduit is yeah. two and a half inch or two inch. So it should go through. Here is the hill that has this underground conduit. We're pulling the wire through it all the way down. Okay, so we have the vacuum set up down the hill. We've never done it before, so we're just gonna try it and see what happens. Okay, let's, let's do it. Okay, let's start. We are done. Let me check it. Woohoo! Yes, I have this drink. <laughs> Let me. Yeah, okay, we are done. Toast part. It's so easy. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's. Oh, 
already here. Wow, it's here. Okay, we are done this part. What's up next? Okay, next one I need to bring a big rope and I have to connect it from the top again and I will pull it. Just wait for me. Okay, next step, rope. It's a nylon one, very strong. So we're gonna tie the string with the rope and pull it down again. So I'll, I'll use this sticky tape. It's electrical tape. Yeah, so that they both stay together. We've got this ready, nice and tight. We don't want it to disconnect inside the pipe. So I'm gonna push it down and he's gonna pull down the hill. Okay, okay I'm pushing. Okay, let's start. Okay, done. I have a rope here. Hey. Okay, done. I have a rope here. Nice. So this is how the other end of the conduit looks like. We got to do the string and the rope pulled through. Nice. No. Okay, last step. Yeah. We need to pull these three very thick copper wires through the conduit. Um, we made a mistake. We should have gone with the rope the other way from the bottom uphill so that we have the end of the rope here. Now this way, we've done it differently. This way, either we have to cut the rope, which we don't want because it's nice, um, or we have to go down with the wires and the rope in the same conduit. We're gonna try and do the wire and the ropes uh, and the rope in, uh, at the same time. So now we're gonna tie them with the sticky tape very tightly so they stay together. And then we're gonna push it through the conduit. Those wires were so heavy. After some time of wrestling with them, we decided to pull them by a tractor because pulling them by hand was just impossible. So we tied the rope to the tractor and moved slowly, pulling the wires out along with the rope. It seemed to work.
Yeah, so all the all the wires are out, they're pulled through the conduit. We just left uh, a small piece at the beginning to be able to connect them to the uh, existing wires up the top. The entire wire <coughs> is right here in the trench now and uh, we're gonna put them put the wire in the remaining conduit and connect them uh, to the existing ends. That's it for this project. We have more projects to come, so stay tuned and come back to our channel for more videos. Thank you!